Hello, Firecore fans. I'm one of your hosts, John Lynch, and today I just want to give you a little heads up before I start this video. Um, when Carly and I sat down to play Okami, we did not realize how long of an intro this game had. So, about the first 20 minutes, or this entire first episode actually, is pretty much just all an introduction video with us kind of voicing over the characters. So, if you want to sit and watch it, um, feel free to. I will be uploading both episodes simultaneously, so if you want to skip forward to the second episode and get straight to the gameplay, feel free to do that as well. Um, but either way, I hope you enjoy, and as always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Love you all, and thanks for watching. What's up, YouTube? John Lynch here, one of your hosts of Firecore Fantasy is joined by another one of your hosts. Hey guys, it's Carly and we are back and we're playing Okami. 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 This is um, a game that I've never played before. It's by Capcom. It came out in 2000 and says 2006, 2008, so somewhere in between there. Yeah. Um, okay. <laughs> but uh, it's a very Japanese style game. I, that's all I really know about it. And you play as like a wolf. Yeah. So oh. here's some demo gameplay. This is perfect. This is yeah. Yep. Uh, okay, it's a little creepy. This is uh oh. Oh. Okay. There. Uh, we're gonna. We're just gonna. Hop there you go. Right there's in. a. Yeah. There's a brief little. Uh... <laughs> continue. <laughs> <laughs> this we could have done the sync on this. Uh, continue. Oh well. New game, I guess. We'll just yeah. We'll, whatever. We'll jump right into it. Well. Yeah. Our sync was a little iffy uh, with this. You might not know what we mean by that, but take our word for it. It was a little iffy. Oh, shoot. I never started the timer. I am so... <laughs> Every single time. Bad at that. Uh, story? <laughs> uh, yes. Yeah. Um, I don't know anything about this game. We, uh, we just picked it up. Um, this is a new thing we're kind of doing. Um, we're just been picking up random smaller titles and just kind of playing a little bit of them, getting a taste of them. Um... Mm -hmm. You know, if they get good feedback, or you know, if we like them, or both, uh, or neither, you know, will that? I guess that will determine if we keep playing it or not. I guess maybe that will might be how it works out. I don't really know, um, but we're just kind of experimenting. Um, we recently recorded a, we did Samurai Warriors three. Yep. Uh, we only did like two episodes of it, just to, to kind of fool around. Get a taste, yeah. It wasn't it wasn't like a story heavy game, so we decided not to go mu like much farther with it. Yeah. But uh. We're still, we're just trying to get our feet wet. With oh, that's funny because stuff. Orochi, we were talking about in during that because uh, we Orochi's like a seven-headed serpent that, yeah. Which well, you're one, two, apparently three, four, seeing now. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Apparently he has eight heads yeah. in this. Yeah. Pretty sure Orochi was a seven-headed uh, serpent thing, though. But um, this is wrong. It's not eight heads. Uh, but, yeah, sorry, what, what were you saying? Um, we're, we're just trying to check out more games, give the channel a little more variety. We're doing a lot of longer playthroughs of, um, things like Wind Waker, and we were doing Shovel Knight, which we still have to finish. Yeah. But, uh, we, we want to give you guys some more stuff to watch while we catch up on some of the other things. We, we've stockpiled a lot of episodes of, uh, of Wind Waker, so they're going to be coming out pretty regularly, but, uh... This is kind of for us to just have something to keep capturing, and also... You know, just to kind of break the flow of the channel up a little bit. Yeah. Um, so Give you something fun to watch. Um, all right. So anyway, this wolf, um, there's a wolf. Uh, it's a coat is brilliant as snow. He was dubbed shi ra nui uh, The wolf kept a watchful eye on anyone who ventured outside the village and made a habit of patrolling the streets at night. What a nice wolf. People assume that the wolf to be a familiar of Orochi. A familiar is like a spirit or something, right? Yeah, pretty much. Um, yeah. Anyway, cool. So we're going to play as this fucking wolf. Um, I hope so. I want to bite someone's neck. Can you bite someone's neck as the wolf? I hope so. One villager took it upon himself to face the fearsome Shira Nui. The warrior Nagi attempted many times to challenge the wolf. But his attempts were thwarted by Shiranui's swift movements. Hmm. The wolf was just too sly for the sword. For what's his name? Nari? 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 Nari, Nari. I think. Nari. Before long, the night of the accursed festival had arrived. So exciting. Skip. Come on. Let's go. Hey. Let's get to the gameplay. The white, the white plumbed arrow her uh, herald 
The coming sacrifice. Piercing the sky, the arrow sunk its shaft into the hole. <laughs> oh, shit. The home of Nami. The villager's most beautiful maiden. Oh, is that her on the left right there? Yeah. She's very skinny. Nagi harbored a secret love for Nami. Nagi, Nami, a little confusing. Yep. Determined to put an end to the Orochi once and for all, Nagi traveled to the beast's cave in place of his beloved. Aw. Wait, Nami or Nagi? Which Nagi. one? Is that the boy or the girl? The, the boy. The boy went in place of the girl. Yes. Why would the girl go in general? Oh, to sacrifice. To be a sacrifice, yeah, I just yes. read that, didn't I? Yep. The moon cave, the place as dark as evil itself, served as Orochi's home. As Nagi stood bravely before the entrance, the beast appeared, eyes glowing crimson upon eight thrashing necks. Orochi stood tall before him, anxious for another sacrifice. Nagi leapt with incredible grace, swinging his blade Val valiantly. Valiantly. A little tough one for me. Big word. <laughs> on and on he sliced, well into the moonless night. But Orochi's hide was like steel. The blade left Nari. Left. Nary. Nary. A the, bra the blade left near narrowly a scratch. Yeah, you get it. It didn't hurt him. Yeah. He's good. He's all set. Why is one of his heads upside down? <laughs> At long last, Nagi, his energy spent from the intense battle dropped to his knees fainting and gasping for, for, for breath fatigued and gasping for breath wow <laughs> he <laughs> knew he was staring death in the face eight of them to be exact it was then that the wolf appeared aw shit Damn. as if to protect Nagi but not really <laughs> oh, okay in the darkness of the cave the wolf's coat shined, shone brilliantly alas it was she Ra Nui the wolf that dwelled outside the village. A homeless wolf with with that just kind of um what's it called when you when you like loitering. The, the wolf just loitered around the village. Um people threw trash at it and the two beasts struggled wildly, thrashing in the darkness. This sounds hot. Yeah. It's but the Bodily shot. fluids were exchanged. Oh. Oh no. Orochi pushed against Shiranami's force as he pushed back. Mysterious and terrifying, the spectacle continued. Shirunami summoned gusts of divine wind to counter Orochi's flames. Shit. I guess we're, we're painting the wind. <laughs> the colors of the wind. Painting of the wind. Painting the wind. As Orochi closed in on Shirunami's sharpened claws. I uh, guess what actually uh, everyone there's actually no gameplay in this game. Yeah, it's just it's a literally story. it's just This is a very long introduction. <laughs> you spend uh, $15 and you just get a narrative story that you have to like hit the button to to prompt the next dialogue. Uh, Orochi protected the mystical um, protected the mystical power but was not easily best bested. Shirunami covered in gashes. <gasps> Majestic coat dyed crimson. Oh, that's red. Yes. Okay, he That's was so tired. sad. Can we just skip this? Fucking no, just... we gotta know the story. We gotta... Orochi, Orochi saw a chance so... to strike. <laughs> what would be the final blow? But sure knew he refused to give in. This last ounce of strength. And the majestic wolf gazed and <laughs> unleashed a mighty howl. Suddenly, black clouds dissipated. And everyone was happy. And there was the moon. And Orochi was off frame, so he didn't matter. The light from the gl oh, okay. Oh, uh, the moonlight glistened off his sword. Beacon of hope. Oh. Okay. Sorry. That's cool. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Guided by his sword, Nagi, who had been taking shelter in the shadows, stood proudly to face his adverse adversary, challen channeling all his strength into his into his scarred and battled arms. He leaped ferociously towards Orochi, his sword posed high. The golden sword danced in his hands like a puppet on a string. One by one, Orochi's fearsome heads separated from their owner. That's shit. Wow. That's oh, now uh, they have masks. Look at them. It's Masamune Date, Hideyoshi Toyotomi, and Nobunaga Oda. I don't know, maybe not, I don't know. Orochi's broken body collapsed in the lake of its own blood. Dude. 
In that instant, the curse that plagued the villagers lifted. The game is over. The boss is defeated. <laughs> Everything is fine. Thanks for playing. That's we it. actually just bought like this a demo. This is the game. <laughs> like, I remember I like borrowed a DVD from my cousin's house. I thought it was like, I was like, oh, you guys have um, uh, Hellboy. I'm like, yeah, I'll take it. Yeah, I rent it. I got home and I put it in, and it's like a 15 minute preview of the movie. Stop it. I'm like, who even has a 15 minute preview on a desk in like <laughs> on a disc DVD. case? Yeah, like, where, what? All right, Carly, nobody cares. Okay, he's he's sad. It's cool. Then everything happened, and the beasts come back, and there's more tr There's more stuff that we have to fight. So we're The gonna wolf go died. The wolf died. What? No. The wolf is dead. So who do we play as? I don't know. What? Oh, we play as the spirit. Okay, there's a shrine. They erected a shrine, among other things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they did. Nagi's right. sword was christened to uh, so cute. Okay. place inside the moon cave. The villagers all looked forward to an age of endless peace, but they were wrong. <laughs> Maybe we were wrong. Uh, I watched. Whoa. Oh my god, I thought the story was over. There is more to this tale than most people oh. know. 100 years had passed since Nagi and Shura knew he's here. Let me exploits. tell you about it! <laughs> So quickly that no one in the village even took notice. But we're gonna walk you through the whole thing, yeah. nice and slow, and slowly but surely. Oh my god! If you think you're gonna this be able cool. to play this game, you're fucking wrong. <laughs> All right, so that's the. Oh, Whoa, who's oh, this guy? Hello. Question mark? Question mark? Is this the legendary sword? Is this legendary sword? Is this Tsukuyomi, the sword that banished the dreaded Orochi? <laughs> yeah. Is that the sword talking? Oh. I'm gonna take it. <laughs> yeah. No, it couldn't be. <laughs> it's just a legend. Nothing but a fairy tale. Oh yeah. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, okay. Eight heads. We're gonna. Oh shit! He's like, oh shit. We're gonna dispel the evil spirits. Uh -oh. That's cool. Um, this is why you don't pick up swords that are stuck in rocks, kids. This is why you don't pick up swords that aren't yours. Dude, my cousin did this a couple years back. Got in a lot of trouble. Unleashed an entire eight-headed dragon thing. Yeah. He who seeks... Oh! Power. You forgot the O. I missed it. You go. He who seeks... Hold on, ready? <laughs> oh, he who seeks power. He who has broken my bonds. Speak the words. I wish... Darkness unto the world. Utter that prayer unto me and unleash my power. He's like, oh shit. Oh, <laughs> Say it. Say it. Say it. Do it. That must be pretty intimidating. That's making the Wii Remote shake, so, um. <laughs> I'm a little bit. And it doesn't even have a vibration function, so you know it's legit. <laughs> Wait, how am I? So wait, he just needs someone to like wish that he. I at... think he's just gonna cause destruction. He's just like teasing him. Like, Fine. Look at he's, he's. But I thought he needed someone to release him. He was released already. No, but he. Why, why was he like, oh, speak the prayer and then I'll be able to like. I don't know. He's like, or I'll just, just start doing it. I guess. <laughs> or I'll. Uh, I'll just fuck shit up. Just, just do it myself. I, I really like like the painting look yeah, of this game. Yeah, it's it's really cool. It's like some things are almost three D, and then they're not really. And it it's a cool like swirling pattern, very stylistic. Mm. A horrible tragedy suddenly swept over the land. However, no kidding. There was one village that seemed to escape the terrible curse. New the York. The tiny settlement of Ka Ka Kamiki. <laughs> Manhattan. Village. Enjoying the protection of a sacred tree. <laughs> Seeing as how New Jersey was already in a similar state to begin with, uh, not much had really changed for them. Oh my! I remember I was my mom and I went to go see World War Z yeah. in theaters, and we were watching it, and it was just, it just like cut to this like convenience store, it was like trash convenience store, <laughs> where like windows broken. It was like whatever, whatever, like New Jersey. I'm like, oh, I'm like, I'm like, it looks like like the zombies <laughs> haven't gotten to New Jersey yet. Uh, oh, look at her! She's so cute. Wood spirit. Sakura, you know why they call her the wood spirit? <laughs> How troublesome. This is just like the ancient prophecy of doom. What has transpired to bring about such a calamity? I don't know. What do you want from me? Why don't you talk louder? That's all. We must act quickly. <laughs> I Keep going with the voice. You got it. 
There's no time to lose. Do Ross's voice. I can't do Ross's voice. Oh, no, it's <laughs> They animated her boobs to jiggle. So really? You missed that? We have never needed your power more. <laughs> Shine your divine light upon this broken and polluted world. <laughs> Let your heavenly rays become our hope as you slide into all of us. <laughs> oh. As my as fucked. <laughs> so she released the wolf's body spirit? I don't know. I was... Dude, that's sick. I'm back, bitch! <laughs> He's adorable. I'm a Tarasu. I'm gonna name him. I have son. wings. Ah! Such ah! Such divine white light! Such beauty and grace! <laughs> the only one capable of such a wonderful spectacle is none other <laughs> than our mother and our origin of all is all that is Amaterasu. <laughs> Now, delightful to see that the Savior whose brave sacrifice sealed away the evil demon so many years ago has not changed one bit. <laughs> Seeing you emerge after so many years spent as a statue brings, like, so much happiness to my heart. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm> tired. <laughs> Oh shit, she hit puberty. Ha ha ho. Oh, oh. Ha ha ha. I just wanted to be fucked. <laughs> oh shit, there was actually something in there. Pew! What on earth? What the heck? You again. Wait, what? I, I don't know. Is it a bug? I don't know. Is it a mushroom? It looks like a bug. Are you nuts? <laughs> let's, let's try to get a little bit in there. Yeah. <laughs> you sure make a big fuss. I was just trying to, you know, look around. Imagine if this is like Kagoya. Wow. Whatever the the little flea from um, any I don't know what's his name. I don't, I don't know. Kagoya, I think. I, d I don't know. No, now I have to look Are it up. Are you napping in my closet, bug? Well. I told you a thousand times not to call me that. I'm a wandering, I'm a wandering artist who literally jumped into your tits. <laughs> Isua. Isua. Wandering artist Isua. Oh, Asun. Sorry, I can't read this font. I'll show you just how great I am, and it won't be long till you're bowing before my great brush. Oh. Hold on. That's, uh, that's, uh, very sexual. Hold on, I'm trying to find the character. It says Shomaru. Oh my goodness. What happened? He just painted. Oh. He painted her. Look at that. What do you think? Even cuter than the real thing? No. 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 Not really. What's with you, furball? You look kind of down in the dumps. Actually, you look kind of familiar. Got it. You look just like that statue of Shirinawi. I just ate it. We, j we ate it. What do you think you're doing? Are you crazy? The amount of, like, introduction and storytelling. Yeah. That is, can we just play the game? Just, uh, Carly, hit the plus button. All right, just skip it. Guys, just we're it. just gonna... Yeah. We've spent almost 20 minutes just 
Hey, hey, finally! Do we go in here? I have no fucking idea. I don't know. I'm not really sure because we skipped the introduction. Oh my god. <laughs> Where are we? I get off. See, he doesn't even know. It got awfully quiet all of a sudden. I don't remember any place like this in the village. Well, we better keep our eyes peeled. You can use the control pad to look around. Or not. The two button changes your point of view. Boy, you really look so helpless. You sure are going... Are you... Uh, yes. Fine. Dude, this game is so cool. Look at the stars. I don't like this. It's the same pattern over and over again. Yep. You don't like this? No, I didn't like the, the view control. It was a little oh, weird. It's making me dizzy. Making me dizzy. Mm, blah, blah. Can I jump off the world? No. Okay. Um. Two button to what? I don't know if I'm sick right now or if this game is like making me sick, dizzy. Look at how far I can jump. Oh, hold on. That's an or origin mirror. Oh. They say once your reflection appears in its surface, your memories will be stored in the mirror for all. So this it's is a how you save. It's a save point. Mm -hmm. You can save her. Okay. Wait, all right. Can, shut up. You should save often. You should save often. This is cool. Z to save? Okay. Mm. This. Please do not touch the, touch the power button. Yes. Do you wish to save here? <laughs> and here? And here? Wow, cool. That. Alright, whatever. This is really, like... I... These I, graphics are making me dizzy. Look at how much you can jump. <laughs> Look, look at all these pots just waiting to be broken. Oh, is this a Zelda game? Yeah. Like, swing the Wii remote to bust them. Oh wow. Okay. How are the controls? They're they're kind of weird. Really? Yeah. Way to go. You can do that anytime. Okay, I will. Thanks. All right. Yeah, this is a. Firecore fantasy fans, I'm so sorry it took us so long to get to the gameplay of this game. Thanks for bearing with us and bearing with us and listening to us voice over these uh, characters in the intro. Um, perhaps we might do a second episode of this, um, just because I feel like we didn't really get enough actual content of game plan. Yeah, there's not a. We, there wasn't so, much beforehand, but uh, yeah. I'm probably gonna put a little notice up at the beginning of this. I mean, yeah. I'll, I'll post it anyway, but like. The, yeah, yeah there's there's not much to this. Yeah, but uh, we'll 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 definitely do a second episode and uh, go go exploring or something. Yes, check us out next time on Firecore Fantasies. Bye, guys.